Now, our next finalist is a 10-year-old girl who's got the whole country talking. She made it through last night's semi-final and she's back again tonight. It's Holly Steele. What's your name? Holly. Hi, you You are sailing through to the next round. You are officially now the bravest girl in the world. I'm going with Holly. I messed it up yesterday. I got nervous because there's, like, everyone, like, 50 million people watching. When she broke down on the stage last night, my heart absolutely sank. I know that she was heartbroken. She so desperately wanted to sing. She showed an astonishing amount of courage last night. And she came back on and was, was like a complete professional. I don't know where she found that kind of strength from. I'm in awe of her. I don't know how she did it. I've got to hand it to Holly. She absolutely got it together. She sang her heart out. It was one of her best performances, and she thoroughly, thoroughly deserves her shot in the final. It's really, really amazing um, to be in the final. I'm really excited to sing tonight because I think I can do a really good job of it. Tonight, you look like you really enjoyed that. Yeah, did you? Did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, you were here last night uh, in the semi final, and it was, a, it was a big night for you. What, what, how did that feel in comparison to last night? Um, I was much more like not nervous, and it made me feel better. Really? Yeah. Yeah. You did. You looked really relaxed, really. You've been really enjoying yourself today. Yeah. And, and uh, I think it really did show. Well done. Let's see. Uh, Let's see what the judges made of it. Piers, let's start with you. Well, the trouble is, Holly, you've made half the audience cry tonight. <laughs> so, <laughs> that, was, that was great. What I loved about it was you know, everyone was looking to see how you were going to respond today. You know, were you going to come and, and fall again, you know, and stop singing and be nervous? But look at you, you came and you just sang absolutely beautifully. You had nerveless performance from start to finish. You looked confident. You looked like a little star. And I thought it was wonderful. Yes. Amanda? Holly, I, I absolutely love Phantom of the Opera and I love that song and I had no doubt at all that you would have any nerves today and yesterday I could see how badly you wanted that second chance. You were actually better than yesterday. I'm loving your whole outfit. <laughs> you look beautiful, darling. Congratulations. Thank you. Thanks, Amanda. Lovely comment. So... Holly, Holly, Holly. Uh, OK, so... 
It's only fair that I talk to you like you're an adult, right? Yeah. We're in agreement. Yeah? Yeah. Taking everything into account? Yeah. You were fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. I mean, what I think is important to remember here, apart from all the, all the drama last night, which is a difficult thing to recover from, is that when we first met you, you, you were a little singer, a little dancer, and we said to you, actually, we think you're a really good little singer. And that's what you, you remind us of tonight, is that you chose a really, really tough song. You, you, you cope with all the pressure you're under. I mean, I was li literally sitting on the edge of my seat here, wondering whether you are going to be able to do it or not. I thought you handled it brilliantly. I thought you handled the big notes brilliantly. And I think you put yourself back in the competition, not through pity, but through talent. And that's where you want to be, Holly. Congratulations. Thank you, judges. Wow, some great comments there. Yeah. Much better tonight. Yeah. Enjoyed it a lot more tonight? Yeah, a Oops. lot more. A lot more. If you would like to see Holly at the Royal Variety Performance, then the number to call is 09011 32 22 05. But not yet, not we've seen all ten acts. One more time, let's hear it for Holly Steele! <laughs>